So Heather and I are in the Bose Museum up by Scotch Corner and this room here is showing Spanish art. Uh, some paintings by Goya over here and this lady here was apparently a contemporary of Saint Jerome and Saint Jerome translated uh, the Bible uh, from Greek into Latin and Heather and I have been to Saint Jerome's cave in the Holy Land as we look round here this is a piece of art that you would have above an altar in the church I don't think we can get it in our um, he'd hide it under our coat or in Heather's handbag it's quite impressive reminds me of a rude screen uh, down in Albi, Albi Cathedral that they cut a big hole through the rude screen uh, priceless piece of art but that sort of thing would have this sort of these panels here, they close them every day, so they open and close them every day. So these panel panels uh, close, and that panel closes, and they open them every day. And a lot of these are scenes from the Bible. So we've just seen Judith and Holofern in the other room. And this is a picture, a depiction of John the Baptist. And here's the Holy Family, St. Elizabeth and St. John the Baptist. Over here picture of St. Jerome in the wilderness. And this is a picture of St. Andrew, uh, his martyrdom, typically depicted as being martyred on a sort of diagonal cross, a saltire. So when you see the St. Andrew's cross on the Union flag uh, in a blue diagonal, that reminds us of St. Andrew's martyrdom on the saltire cross. And here we have the Tears of St. Peter by El Greco. El Greco Dominicos Theotokopoulos uh, had many f wealthy patrons apparently in Toledo in Spain and Heather and I have been to Toledo I think Toledo is famous for making swords as well there's a big cathedral there I think in one of the other rooms we've just seen a picture of uh, Archduke Albert of Russia I think uh, in his, when he was a young man uh, he was Archbishop of Toledo, I believe. Here we have St. Francis ascending into heaven. Brown robes there, that look quite reminiscent of Franciscan monks wearing brown. Depiction of Christ with the, his, the, the spear wound in his side. These two paintings caught my eye. So here we have four fathers of the church. And, and the bottom here, I think on the left is Saint Jerome. Uh, we just talked about him previously and he translated the uh, Bible from the Greek into the Latin. And on the right, uh, Saint Ambrose. And above us, we have Saint Gregory and Saint Augustine. And 
They're painted by Juan de Borgogna uh, in the 16th century. And they're part of the Spanish school of art. This trip, I think that's it, called a triptych. Yeah, this, this is a triptych here. And depicts Christ's bodies. They've taken him down from the cross. And there'll be John the, uh, and uh, Mary. Uh, and here we have the depiction of the crucifixion in the triptych. The triptych is the sort of artwork that can be in three panels. There we go. Some of them, obviously, you often get little icons that are triptychs that you put on your shelf or your mantelpiece at home that close up. And these are obviously uh, ones that you put on your wall. And this triptych here was painted by the master of the Virgo Intervagines, 1483 to 1498. It's a crucifixion, another altar piece, so this would have been above the altar. It's part of the Dutch school of art. I think this is my favourite room so far. If you like this video, please click like, then comment, share and subscribe.